hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is green guys i'm not in the garden today i'm in my kitchen guys one of my subscribers asked me if i can smoke my um turkey wings and show how i smoke my turkey wings so guys today i want to smoke my fish my chicken and my turkey wings yes guys i want to smoke them today so i just wanted to make a video for that so guys keep watching yes guys this is my turkey wings i have some at home that's why i'm not gonna smoke a lot of it i just add it so i can show her how i smoke it yes guys and this is my chicken <coughs> i defrost them overnight they are sitting in water i need to wash them and fix them guys and then this is my fish yes i've already washed the fish so now I just need to work on my chicken, guys. Keep watching. Yes, guys. To make your chicken, like, flat, check it out like this. And I take my scissors, my kitchen scissors, and I cut. I need to make, open it so it will be, like, flat. Easy to smoke that way, guys. Yes, guys. Open it. If it's too hard, you use your knife to cut it. Sometimes these bones are hard. See that? That's how you open your chicken. You make it flat. Press it. See that, guys? Just like that. You make your chicken like flat. When you buy this smoked chicken in the store, they are all flat like this. Yeah, that's how you open your chicken. Just use your kitchen knife. This chicken knife is not that. This, I mean, I say chicken knife. This kitchen knife is not that sharp. Just like that, guys. Then you press it up. Then you turn it and then press it again. So, so it stays flat. So that's what I'm going to do with all this chicken, guys. After you finish, guys. You just raise your chicken. I'm removing some of the fat. Just raise the chicken. You see fat? Take them out. Take them out. Take them out, guys. After I finish with the chicken, now I'm going to put my fish in here. I want to salt it a little bit, guys. Yes, I want to salt my fish a little bit. This is um, it's wild fish. It's not farm raised. So we have its natural salt. But I still want to put a little salt in it, guys. A little salt. It's wild fish. I think it's called, I don't know the real name. It's just written, this is the box. YT, I don't know if that's the name. I think the English name is Hept. I don't know if it's Hept Fish. But this is what it is. This is the, the box. I bought it from Restaurant Depot. In a little box like this. Yeah, so that's how the box looks like. Yes, guys. So I just put salt like that. This is like two boxes of it. Comes in little boxes. So I put salt. In my face, just like that. I'm gonna put it back in my shifter so it'll be draining. Yes, guys. After I finish with my with my fish, I sort my fish and I took it out. I just put water in this container, just like that. Then I'm gonna put salt and yes, put salt in here. The salt really is really really salty, guys. Just make it really, yeah, really really salty. Really, really good. because we are not soaking the chicken or the 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 turkey, so make the water really salty, just like that. And I put my turkey in here. I'm not soaking it. I don't want too much salt, so I'm just gonna put it and take it out. Yeah.
put it in any seat for like two minutes. I don't want salt, too much salt to penetrate in my in my turkey. That's why I don't like the turkey in the store. Sometimes they have too much salt in there. I just take them out. I don't rinse it and let the salt be on it. Yes. Don't rinse it. Just leave it. By the time it's smoked and it's ready, this salt will be all, it will not be much on it, but it will make your turkey taste very nice and natural and not too salty. Yeah, the same thing goes with the chicken. I'm going to put the chicken in here. So, just one. Because when they are baking, they are, they are smoking, they are like uh, uh, uh dripping so you drip a lot of those salt out but at the end result will just be naturally nice sweet meat not too salty guys yes that's why i'm not even soaking it just like that i soak all the chicken that's okay i take it out so i run to the bottom first and soak the you shift her like that after you finish sorting it i'm just going to put all of them in this basket so they can drain yeah the chicken and the fish i mean <laughs> the chicken and the turkey wings so they can drain and the fish the fish is separate there yes guys just like that you see the leather drain then we go and start our fire let's go start our fire guys yes guys this is my fire pit hi one of my videos that i smoke fish i show you guys my fire pit and i told you guys i build it myself yes i build this fire pit myself and even the grill this grill i build it myself i bought this uh, uh chicken wire from from home depot and i also bought the uh, i bought the lumber from home depot and the the wire was um three by five feet so i bought the the lumber and i let them cut the long one the long one six six feet and the short one they cut it three but when i came i realized that it was too long so i reduced like half half um half feet out of it in each so yes yes so that's how i just nailed them very simple like this you guys see the nails I just nailed the chicken wire on it just simple like that so this is my fire pit this is where i smoke all my my stuff guys yes this is it i build it very simple i already put my wood in here yes even the wood i don't buy wood guys let me show you guys my wood i have a lot of wood that i can use for 100 years it will never go away look at all this stuff these are wood chips i use them for my garden floor yes these wood chips came from it came from my the wood that they cut in my in my in my yard. I had four big trees at the front. They cut five at the back, four at the front. Yes, I had so many trees. These are my woods. Guys, look at those woods. Guys, I have so much wood. Yes. I can stay in this property all my life. This wood will still stay here. Look at that. So much firewood to use. And this is not all. I have some behind. The other side of my star have wood everywhere guys i have so much wood i give them away people come and ask me and i give them away but i still have a lot guys so much wood that's why i smoke all my stuff guys because i have free stuff free wood free everything <laughs> yes guys so that is my wood guys i already put my firewood in here in here i put also newspaper in here because it's raining, so some of these firewoods are wet. So I put my newspaper so I can start the fire. Yes, guys, I put my my um, lighting through it like this. And then, sometimes hard to start fire when it's so cold and rainy and stuff. Just start my fire like that, guys. Just like that. I'm going to let it burn until it will create like charcoal. We'll start creating charcoal. Then we're going to put our stuff on top of it to smoke them, guys. Just like that. Yes, guys. My fire has burned. It has created a little bit of charcoal. And the fire has calmed down a little bit. So I'm just going to clean my grill. This is like 
I don't know how to call it, like a little iron. I don't know how to call it, guys. I'll just clean my grill. Take off the old food that I did last time here. Just clean it. Just like that guys, then I'm now going to put my stuff in there. Start by putting my chicken. Just like that. You open it flat. If the fire is too much, sometimes just spray water inside. And I put my turkey, guys. Now I'm going to put my fish. Just like that guys, I'm going to cover it now, just let it, let it uh, smoke, after some time I'll come and change the side guys, I will now cover it, guys the reason why I'm using this cowboy is because if you look at it, the chicken have covered all, so there's no way the fire will pass through the chicken to burn my cowboy, that's why I'm using it, yes guys, Use the side that does not have any tape or anything. Cover it like that. You cover it so it keeps the heat inside and the smoke. Yes, guys. So cover it. And the flies. We don't want no flies to touch our meat or our fish. We want our stuff to stay fresh, guys. After you put that, I will not like put the middle wood like that. So wind does not carry my box away. Just like that. See that? Yes, just like that. We're gonna smoke it like that. If you don't have enough fish to cover your your grill or your fat, don't put cowboy, it's gonna catch fire. Yes, you can find something like that, had like something like um uh, aluminum something. That can catch any fire to cover it. I cover it with cardboard because the whole surface of the gray is covered with meat. So there's no way the fire will pass through and burn my box, guys. Yeah, that's how I'm going to smoke it. After some time, I'm going to change the side. And I'm going to be checking my fire. Every time the fire is too much, I'm going to spray water in there. Yes, that's what I'm going to be doing, guys. We're gonna. I will show you when we come back. Yes, guys. Right now, if you look at the fire, it's too much. So I brought my hose. This is what I do. I just open my hose. What happened to the water? <laughs> Let me go fix it. Something happened to it. We don't need too much fire to smoke us. So we just need the smoke and the hot air. Just that. We don't need the fire. Too much fire. Even though it's going to burn our food. So I'm going to put water like this. That's what I do. See that? 
I just spray water in there and it reduce the flame. It's gonna say it's create more smoke. It's gonna take time to to cash again. That's how I smoke it, guys. Just like that. Yep, I'll be checking it time to time, and that's it. Yes, guys. Some I, I put this. I cover like right here because the more because the more open it is the more wind will blow and there will be more flame so i put that and i put a cover like this just to reduce the air that is going in there so it will not cause too much flame guys just like that yeah this uh, this is too small if i had a bigger one that will cover the whole thing i'll use it but that's all i have guys just like that yes guys my fish has been Smoking for like two hours, so we're gonna ch check it. See, we can flip it right now. Ooh, looks good, guys. Looks so good. See that? Wow. Oh God, look at that. Mmm. Everything looks perfect. I need to flip them. Yes, guys. So easy to to to, to smoke your own thing. So easy, guys. Oh my God. Hot, it's burning me. Like the ones at the corner, that I will, I will move them closer inside. Yeah. Ooh, so hot, guys. So hot. It's just burning my hands so bad. Some of them I will move like the ones that I I put them in the middle a little bit. Okay, so things are hot. Can I see that? I have my fish right here. Uh, this fish you call it YT. I <laughs> know that the name is written in the box. This fish. I bought them from a restaurant depot. Yes, you know, on the bus is written Pacific Wild Pacific Whitey. So I don't know if that's a real name, guys. Yeah. That's how it's written. Yeah, guys, okay, so that's how it looks. I'm flipping all of them just like that, flipping everything. Yep. That's how it's. Guys, if, if you want to smoke your stuff, no rush. Just take the day you're off. You need to smoke it, you take time. Don't rush it. If you rush it, it's going to burn your stuff. Yeah, take the day you're off and just smoke your fish, guys. That's what I do. Yes, the smoke very fit, guys. The smoke hope. See how they look? Yes. Just like that. Simple, simple, simple. Simple, simple, guys. I just flip all of them. Just like that. Yeah, just have just just a little more time to go and it will be over, guys. It's not hard smoking your stay It's very easy, actually. Just like that, guys. I'm going to cover it again. And let it sit there again. I'll be, I still check them, though. I don't just leave there. Come and check the fire because you don't want your fire to catch so much that it will burn your food instead. So that's what I do, just like that. 
yes guys let's check let's see how our uh, chicken and uh, turkey and fish is doing I'll, I'll, I'll flip it again Hey guys, yeah, I think the chicken is ready. See the chicken, it's ready. Yeah, so I'm gonna take up the chicken and the turkey. I don't want them to dry too much. Look at the turkey. I don't want them to dry too much. So I'm gonna take them out. But I'm gonna continue smoking the fish. Chicken is well dry like that, guys. It's well smoked. It's very easy to smoke your chicken and your turkey. Fish take longer than them. You know, this one, they smoke fast. Oh, this one need more time. I'm going to put it here. Let's see my, my turkey. Turkey wings and my chicken. I'm going to continue smoking the fish. Yeah, let's smoke the fish. It need more time. Need more time, guys. So continue to smoke the fish just like that. Yeah, I'm gonna cover it. I'm not even gonna add more flame. I'm just gonna leave the remaining fire that's there to just continue. And now, look at the chicken and the turkey, guys. Look how beautiful it is. Okay, let's continue smoking, guys. Yes, guys, my fish is completely dry. I'm going to take it off my chicken, too. I'm just going to take my chicken up, put the chicken in there, put my fish. Just like that, guys. Just like that. Simple, 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 guys. Yes, guys, I'm done smoking everything. Look at them. This is the fish. Smoke beautifully. This is the... This chicken is the Umbasanjo chicken. Yeah, Umbasanjo chicken, the hard one. Yes, I've used it in my cooking so many times. That's the small chicken, the small hen. Look at that, the fowl, the hard one. Yeah, that's the chicken right there. And you have the turkey wings. Yes, you have the turkey wings. This turkey wings is a smaller turkey wing. They are the ones we normally see in the store sometimes have like the full wings. Yeah, this one, they took off some of the wings. Some, not some of the, they took off some part of it. Yes, guys, so this is my turkey wings. Easy to smoke. The chicken and the turkey, they will smoke so fast. Yes, guys, they smoke fast than the fish because the fish have more, uh, more moisture. So it takes a little bit time to smoke. The chicken and the, um, the turkey smoke for like five hours. It was done, but the fish took longer. Yes, the fish took like mm, seven hours. So that's just how I smoke my stuff, guys. Easy, easy, easy like that, guys. The other thing, if you guys like salty meat or fish, guys, like the turkey wings and the chicken, you can just soak it in that salt water at least for an hour. Yeah, just soak it like this for an hour. You can put whatever seasoning you want in your chicken. It's up to you. But I just like my chicken lightly salted, just light. So I, when I'm cooking it, I can put whatever spices I want, whatever seasoning I want in it. So I don't want it to over, I don't like over salty, um, uh, meat or fish, anything. I just like the natural taste. So I just put, I don't like them to stay in the salt water for long. No, I don't want it too salty. Yes, guys, that's just how you smoke your stuff. Very simple. Yes, very simple. You see the wings, the chicken. Very simple, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Please, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. 
um please do not forget to subscribe or hit the notification bell guys share this video with your friends and family if you're a new subscriber here yeah, welcome welcome to karen's family if you're a returning subscriber here yeah, thank you thank you for keep coming back thank you for keep watching my videos guys thank you guys so much see you next time bye bye